Hello guys, welcome to the Free Amers West Ham United 125th Anniversary Legends Series. We're at number 38 and what a guy this man is. Probably scored two of the most important goals in West Ham's history. That man is Mr. Alan Seeley. The winger was the man who braced at Wembley to secure the European Cup Winners' Cup with a 2-0 win over West German side TSV 1860 Munich in May 1965. Seeley's sharp reactions and even sharper finish were enough to win the Hammers the first and so far only continental title. Born in Hampton in February 1942, Seeley started his senior career with Orient before making the short switch to the bowling ground in 1961. The presence of Peter Bradbrook restricted Seeley's first team's opportunities but when they came around, boy, did he take them. Having broken into the side in April 1961, the outside right scored eight goals in his first 19 games in the first division, helping the Hammers challenge at the top of the table in the first half of the 1961-62 season. The goals continued to flow steadily if not prolifically, over the next two seasons before Seeley was given his chance to shine in the 1964-65 European Cup Winners' Cup run. With Bradbrook injured, the Londoner started seven of West Ham's nine ties, scoring in the second round over uh, Spartak Prague at the bowling ground in November 1965. And of course, twice in three second half minutes in the famous Wembley win. The first saw him clip a pass from Ronnie Boyce and slam the ball into the top corner before doubling his tallow with a close range finish after Martin Peters had helped on Bobby Moore's cross. And there it is there. Now immortalised with a plaque at the London Stadium, Seeley sadly passed away in 1996, aged just 53. His contributions to the history of West Ham United will never be forgotten, and rightly so. Number 38, European Cup, winner, Cup Winners' Cup goalscorer, Mr. Alan Seeley.